We all have those people in our lives, those people who are really special to us, those people who mean the world to us. Friends from high school, friends from childhood, people you've met, family members, but we're all so busy. It's like a badge of honor now, right? How many times do you ask a friend, how are you doing? And they say, oh my God, I am so busy. How many times do you answer that way? I know I answer that way all the time, though it's a habit I'm really trying to break. You guys, we can't be too busy for the people in our lives, the important people in our lives. You have to not find the time, you have to make the time. You have to make those relationships a priority. You need to schedule the time. My very best, oldest, dearest friend lives in New Orleans. We haven't lived in the same city in decades. And we schedule our phone calls. Lorelai, I'm shouting out to you, right? Because if we just wait until the stars align and we have time together, it never happens. So we will literally schedule phone calls. I have a very dear friend, Sue. I'm, sh I'm shouting out to Sue in New Jersey. She moved to New Jersey. It's the other side of New York City. She is one of my favorite people in the world. And I haven't seen her in years because we are, say it with me, we are too busy. It has to change, you guys. Every bit of research tells us that the most important things for our happiness and our longevity are the quality of our personal relationships, our ability to connect in our community and also to connect with those people who are super, super special to us. But the only way that's gonna happen, literally the only way that it's gonna happen is if you make that time carve out that time and make it a priority. So Lore, Sue, I'm gonna make it a priority to find time for us to be together, to reconnect, and to share those experiences that are all important. To everyone out there who is thinking, oh, I have these people in my life who I love, who I adore, who I know are important to me, show them that they are important to you. Does social media count? My answer is sort of. Social media is a good way to at least keep track of the major things happening in other people's lives. But hitting like on a post from somebody you love is not enough. You have to make the time. And that should be a commitment that we all make in the coming weeks.